What's going on guys? El Tiburon here, aka Retro Tiburon, with an unboxing video. I got a box in the mail. It finally showed up. This big boy, TMNT Turtle Van, made by NECA, the one and only NECA. So, uh, what do you say we open this sucker up? Here it is. Very, very well packed, I must say. Check this out, guys. Check out this packaging. I typically don't like to keep packaging and kind of tempted to keep this one. Just a, like how cool does the, the art look on this? Like straight out of the cartoons, but it's a big box, so who knows? I don't know if I'm gonna be keeping the box. Let's see the, what's in here. I think this might be my last big purchase from NECA. Just because, you know, stuff is so expensive, man. I had to um, kind of draw the line of, on a lot of the NECA figures, TMNT figures. Because um, I was kind of collecting a lot of them, or most of them, up to maybe, the, maybe a couple years ago. Where I was like, you know what? Do I really need the guy in the background or this guy that came out in one episode? Nah, man, I, I don't. I don't need um, Scrag. That, that's no disrespect for the the Scrag fans out there, but I don't really need Scrag. I got the TMNT movie running in the background. I don't need Danny from the Turtles movie. You know what I mean? Trying to make some cuts. Yeah, this is a this is a this is a big toy here. Look at this massive freak! Jesus Christ! I have a spot for it like above this detail. I don't even know if it's I don't even know if it's gonna fit up there. This thing's huge. By the way, if my energy's a little low, I'm kind of hungover. FYI. Oh boy. Look at this, guys. Check this out, man. It looks like straight out of the freaking cartoon. This is awesome. I'll show some little, like, close up shots of it. Because uh, I'm really afraid to drop this. Because I know if I drop this. It's gonna break and then I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna curl up in the fetal position and cry. And it has like little bolt, uh, it has the headlights. I wonder if those light up. Um, yeah, let's take, let's take a closer look at this. So yeah, check this out guys, you can open up the, the van, and uh, yeah, it has a lot of little compartments, a lot of stuff you can add. I'm right now working on this little, I guess it's like a turret seat that attaches here. It's just, you know, got a little bit scary because you paid so much for this, you don't want to break anything. Um, so I'm trying to be really careful because typically I'm kind of a Neanderthal and break stuff very easily. Um, it also comes like with little backdrops for the the turtle van that you can put in here. Um, so it's got this. It's got this one right here. It's like a weapon rack, kind of. Um, this one, I'm. I guess it's just like a plain background, I guess, so you can put in there. Kind of boring. And then there's like this one, like an extra turret, I guess. Maybe for the other door. I'm not really sure, but. I think I might, you know, leave it as is. Just put the, the little gunner seat 
just because I don't want to break anything and um, you know I'm not really gonna be opening this toy up once I once I put it uh, up on my my detail for display I'm not really gonna be messing with it so I think I'm gonna leave it as is I'm gonna just try to figure out how to put a figure in here so you'll, you'll be seeing the the finished product right now I already so currently I have the super 7 TMNT figures up here for for the display the topper I guess like the cake topper almost for my TMNT 80s cartoon detail but unfortunately sometimes you know as a toy collector there's only there's only enough room <laughs> you know there can only be room for one thing so I'm gonna unfortunately have to take these guys off the off the top and um, put the, the turtle van that's gonna be the new display piece for now so kind of bummed out because these figures right here they're freaking awesome man super seven knocked it out of the park with these TMNT figures, but um, yeah, this is, where, this is where I'm gonna be putting the turtle van, so let's get to work. So here's the finished product, guys. Check this out. We got Mikey, sorry, not Mikey, we got Raph on the gunner, on the turret. We got Donatello, you know, he built this thing, so he should be the one behind the wheel. I wouldn't trust Michelangelo behind the wheel, even though he is my favorite turtle. You got my, Mikey riding shotgun. I don't know if you can see him, but back there. I don't know if you can see him, but back there somewhere is uh, Leonardo telling Donatello where to go. You know, you know how, how bossy Leo is. Always telling the other turtles what to do. Always being the party pooper. Um, and, and just next to them I put, uh, I wanted to display for a long time April O'Neil and Vern, I think his name was Vern or Vernon, right? I don't even remember his name, but I couldn't make room for April O'Neil and uh, Top D Tolf. There's a lot of figures I, I wasn't able to fit in here. I still have Slash from the cartoon. Uh, I think I have the Rat King didn't make the cut and uh, I was uh, thinking of rotating the, the figures but man I don't know I feel like if I take one out it's gonna be like a domino effect and they're all gonna fall down so I might just leave it as is at least for now this little guy made the cut though a little pizza monster but um, as for now I'm, I think I might just leave it as is and I kind of put the the turtle van to the left. I didn't want to put it dead center, uh, just because I wanted to put like you know I put April up here, Vern or Vernon, whatever his name was, and maybe the Rat King can go back here or Slash or something you know in the backdrop. Um, but yeah, man, really happy with this, with this toy, with this uh, van. I wonder. I'm still wondering if these light up. If anyone knows out there, do these light up? It looks like it does have like some wiring in there, so maybe it does, but I don't know if it's reachable now that I set it up, if it, if it has a switch somewhere, but um, yeah, you know what I, I also did? I added some, um, it's kind of this like goop. Let me show it to you guys. Hold on. This thing kind of comes in the clutch right here. Crystalline wax, uh, clear museum wax really good like for putting up like uh, figures it's supposed to be earthquake proof quake hold um, we live out in Cal I live out in California so I don't know how 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 effective this is gonna be on when and if we get hit with a big one but hopefully it'll it'll stay up there I put it on the wheel so it doesn't roll off or anything um, but yeah Super happy with this. NECA, as always, knocks it out of the park. That's it, guys. Cowabunga.